You have what it takes to become a citizen. When immigrants want to become a citizen of the United States, they must take a civics test as part of their naturalization interview. The INS looks for a score of 80% or higher. Let's see how the people of Southern do. Do you want to answer a history question? Well, of course, unless it's about Hitler, you mean. Matt, who said, give me liberty or give me death? Um, you did. <laughs> I should so know this one. Give me liberty or give me death. It was a president, right? Lyndon B. Johnson? Oh, no. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Patrick Henry. Patrick Henry. That is correct. All right, so who has the power to declare war? I believe that is the Senate. Wasn't that a big co a controversy with Bush? Why do I got to answer the question? Congress. That is correct. Wow. All right, let's ask these people who are practicing on being homeless some history questions. How many stripes are on the American flag? Seven. Stripes? Yeah, the, the red and white stripes on the American flag. Uh, I should know, but I don't. 27. 13. Very yeah. good. Can you tell me what was the 50th state in the United States? I would have to say it's Alaska. Give me a hint. Philadelphia. Washington. Um, I believe, I believe it was Hawaii. What is the minimum voting age for American citizens? I don't know. Stop, yeah? I don't know. Am I supposed to? Min minimum voting age is 18 for most of them. That is correct. 18. Can you tell me who wrote the Star Spangled Banner? I need a life. Oh, yeah, I do. Can I have a lifeline? Um. George Washington? <laughs> Sorry, that is in no way correct. Francis Scott Key. That is correct. As soon as you're done washing your hands, we'll be right here. Can you tell me who becomes president if both the vice president and the president of the United States dies? I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Columbus? <laughs> me. The answer is not you. Sorry. The answer would be the Speaker of the House. Who's that? I have no idea. <laughs> well, I'm going to have to say that was god-awful. I am completely embarrassed, and I hope these people burn in hell. Can you tell me what the basic beliefs for the Declaration of Independence are? Basic beliefs? Basic beliefs. Like, what's it mean? It just means your freedom.